April is Earth Month, so in this morning's Consumer Confidential, we are talking about smarter purchases that are good for the planet and your wallet. Here to help us is NBC News Senior Consumer Investigative Correspondent, Vicki Wynn. Vicki, good morning to you. Yeah. My favorite topics. Really? Do this for the environment. Well, yeah, you know what? 100%. I think a lot of times people, you start talking about, you know, sustainable lifestyles and that kind of thing. I think they think it means you're going to break the bank. Like, yeah. it's going to be expensive to live that way. Not at all. Living sustainably can actually be much cheaper than living a consumerism lifestyle, mm. right? And it really starts with your mindset. Listen, 78% uh, of people who sur were surveyed by Nielsen IQ said, I do want to live a more sustainable lifestyle, but how do I do it? Well, one, you make these small adjustments. You ask yourself this question, do I want this item? And do I need this item? And do I need it now in this moment? Oh. We talked to a sustainability expert. Her name is <coughs> Ashley Piper. She's been on the show before. Mm. She started this No New Things Challenge. Mm -hmm. She did it for a year. She says she saved $22,000. So wow. it's like no more things than what do you mean? Like not use shopping your own closet, shopping your own wow, pantry, so nothing saying new. no to buying anything swapping new, mm -hmm. using the things that you already have. And, you know, trying to just say, like, that is a really cute new scarf or headband or sandals, but you probably have a few of those things wow, already. Mm -hmm. Also, a big part of our budget is, is food. Yeah. And yes. and we waste so much mm. food and we could buy if we were a little more sustainable, we would actually save money. Definitely, Al. If we save food, we save money. It's a no brainer. And you look at the numbers, they're staggering. The EPA says in twenty nineteen, the most recent number, sixty six million tons wow. of food wasted by yeah. restaurants and residences, our own homes. That works out to about $1,500 on average for the American family of four. You could put $1,500 back in your pocket by shopping your pantry and your fridge first, using all of those things that you bought last week before you hit the grocery store and oh, make yeah. the list. Now, the USDA says once you do go to the grocery store, Always shop with a list of exactly what you need, but yeah. try to clear out that pantry yeah. and fridge yeah. first. There's and a lot of stuff in there. That there's so you, much stuff in the You could probably find goods. a recipe or something to make with it. That's 100% what I would recommend is searching for recipes. What can I make? AI is out there mm -hmm. now. Yeah. What can yeah. I make with this, this, and this in mm. my pantry? You'll come up with something great and use what you already have. Composting food scraps, mm. that's great for the environment. It also provides soil for your garden. I do that. It's fun for the kids, too. Yeah, and see they it all like, love to dirt. see the worms in there, too. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And then this is one of my favorite tips. Try food recovery apps. We've talked about too good to go before. Mm. This is restaurants, cafes, yep. grocery stores. You pay a small fee. You pick up food that they would otherwise throw out. The other app that's new is called Olio, O-L-I-O. -O. Try it. It's free. Literally, let's say you're going on vacation. You've got too much fresh produce. You don't want it to go to waste. Ooh. You put it on Olio. People People are doing that too. You can pick up some amazing food wow. for free that way. That's wow. great. What are some other things you can do, like in your own home, to keep keep costs down and still be green? Energy is a big one for us, Craig. So the EPA says, think about the rooms that you turn on the lights the most, the five rooms or however many rooms. Replace the light bulbs in every single room with LED yeah. or energy efficient light bulbs. Those can last up to 50 times longer than a regular incandescent light bulb and save you up to $70 a year. A leaky toilet, I had no idea, a leaky toilet can cost oh. up to 200 gallons of water wow. per day. So make what? sure you fix yep. leaks, wow. conserve water by running a full dishwasher load. That'll save you 40 bucks a year. And then the this is a big pet peeve of mine, those single-use plastics, whether mm -hmm. it's a plastic bag yeah. or a plastic water bottle, just say no. And if you bring a reusable cup to Starbucks, they'll give you 25 stars. They'll pour your iced coffee, your drink, whatever, into that reusable you know, thermos that you have. I use a Yeti. You get 25 stars, you get 200 stars. That's a free, fancy coffee drink that could Ooh, be I like eight that. bucks. <clears throat> yeah, easy. And then finally, birthday parties, carpool. Mm -hmm. You're going, I'm going, I'll Let's take go the together. kids there. Mm -hmm. You pick them up. Then you split the time and it's great for the environment. And of course, public transit when you can, maybe to work sometimes or carpooling right. with friends to work. That's what good. if you want to shop more sustainably if you are going to buy new things? Yeah, the good news is people are really into thrifting. The National Retail Federation says that by 2027, the thrifting secondhand market will double. 2027, that's it. only three years away because it's cool. Kids love it, yeah. right? Because it's vintage, but also it's sustainable. The other thing to do, aside from your local thrift stores, these buy nothing groups, those are really growing in popularity. You can get all kinds of things, kitchen items, clothing, sports equipment, which is very mm -hmm. expensive yes. for kids. Just when it comes to toys, make sure that's not on the CPSC's recall list. Always group your online deliveries. You don't need Amazon coming Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. Just right. do it all on That's one true. day That's and true. repurpose the things that you have. We have so many containers, jelly jars that we reuse oh, for yeah. all kinds of things. Right? Vicki, that was very good. Yeah. Great very good. Good. Happy Thank Earth Month. Thank you, Vicki. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day or 
click the link right here.